Let's play Dupour number 13, what I call L1, L2, and L3, starting at measure 104. Here's our G. Nice and slow. spots, okay? Shifts, practice your shifts. If you use that fingering on L1, there's no shifting required, so work that and get that extension. It's a double extension to the D string and then a triple extension up to the, the high uh, B. L2 is tough. Half step between one and thumb. That's a whole step between one and thumb. That's the hardest shift, I think. Half step between thumb and one. Keep that half step. And that's the end of it. And that's a little harmonic you can rest on and make sure it's in tune. I like to play two for you. Minor. Now you have this minor between one and two, or this half step between one and two. When you shift back, it opens up, whole step, whole step. Stay, keep that whole step, whole step. And now shrink it, thumb goes back a half step. And now, we shrink it, we go back a whole step with the second finger. Uh, I gotta find my place. tenor clef moment. D, B. Keep that same proportion. Actually, no, it goes. Yep. Minor, third. Don't move your thumb when you play that note. Big ol' reach 
first note of the D show. Huge. It's a really big fourth finger. It may not feel like two positions. You may have to figure out how to do this. And then hop back. And then he has... You can do that if you want to, but you just played 2-4. I play two four. First finger. It's not bad. Anyway, I hope that helps you out there practice hard. This is tough.